seven reasons why you should become an api tester all right so let's get started hey guys welcome to the testing academy my name is pramod and we are going to discuss about why you should become an api testers in this video all right i'm going to discuss with you a report also which is created by postman a famous api testing tool and we will discuss about couple of data also which is i mean what other things are important in apis and i'll discuss like seven reason why you should become an api tester right now all right so this video is really important for anyone who is basically want to jump to api testing world or want to enhance their skill set right if if you want to add api testing in your resume then it's a very important video for for you all right so and make sure you watch uh, in 1.5x this video is very short guys to the point i'm going to discuss the exact points i will share a link of the pdf also report of postman make sure you read it because that contains a data why api testing or api testers are growing and why it is an important career option right now okay and to be honest just to give you a disclaimer api testers alone are nothing right there's no there's no opening for only api testers most of the time that you see right uh, so you should know manual testing for that is like a prerequisite so make sure you are aware of that manual testing plus api testing actually they are looking for okay so let's get started awesome the first one uh, the link it is in the description don't worry top 3 countries who are using api requests right according to the report of the state of api if you see we have a 135% increase into 2021 in usa itself and in india it's almost 167% increase what exactly this signifies this signifies that people are using apis and if they are using api so are they, they are developing apis if apis are getting developed who is testing it api testers guys so it's a very very secure job right now if you see and it's a must have skills right now to be added to your resume right now okay and china i know it's unknown data but <laughs> see <laughs> all right and uh, let's jump to the second one let me make this a uh, little bold okay and most popular api architecture style so if you if you know that in apis we have rest shop graphql web sockets and different ways where you can basically structure your apis right or you can create an architectural style so rest if you know it's most so the, according to this report whatever the some samples that they have picked up right so almost 50% of the people still are using rest so yes rest api i i, I think i have all my all, almost my 95% of the videos are around rest so if you are comfortable and rest will stay for long okay and if you see graphql is catching up right now and uh, soap is almost gone uh, like 8% it will be gone after some time because of the certain issues like bandwidth and there's a complex technology which we have to use to implement soap right so rest and graphql definitely will rule and web hooks and web sockets are everywhere i mean they will improve but again i would suggest uh, start with the rest at least for 5 to 10 years it's not going anywhere with 50% of the share right most uh, popular specification if you see json is the i think most importantly used people still are using json and uh, they are trying trying to avoid the xml because xml is little complex to handle and json works very well right so graphql open ui and swagger they are using it for mostly api specification right so api time allocation according to the developers where developers or testers where they are basically consuming the time if you see most of the time if you see around 30% of the time it's for the uh, if you know here right uh, let me move back so here if you see coding or programming the apis after that you see automation testing right so that's what where i'm saying so you need to grab a pie that's it right because you know how to automate an api you know how to manually work with an api after watching the testing academy videos we have a 30 30 day challenges of postman rest assured right and we are coming up with a proper live exam live classes also in future so yes learn from it and you will see that you are you have a very secure job afterwards all right so those things i just wanted to highlight all right now let's come to the uh, seven important reasons which i think are important that you should know and you will find right now uh, let me make it like little smaller and you will uh, so you will find you will find majority of the projects right now right now in mncs and and startups are related to apis so to be honest guys i am i have almost 10 years experience and i have changed almost four to five companies and in my last two company when i was in browsers like right i used to con i used to have a conversation with almost like uh, 40 50 plus qas companies including microsoft google and how they are leveraging right the api testing things and other things so 
I know most of the people right now are using APIs behind the scene and they want to automate them. So you have to take care. You have to learn this technology. Apart from the web automation, make sure you add API testing in your resume. Okay. Easy to transition. I think uh, if you are someone who is in at a manual testing, the first step you can start with is uh, uh, API testing, right? Manual API testing, then go to the automation. Then you can go with the Selenium or web automation also. I have done it myself. I have talked about this. My story was manual testing, switch to what, API automation, then switching to the core uh, uh, web automation and mobile application, right? So those things you can take help from, okay? Uh, I think uh, most of the companies right now you will see they are hiring backend testers. What exactly is a backend tester behind the scene are nothing but they are API testers who are testing their APIs, who are they, who are basically testing their contracts, who are basically testing their API security performance, monitoring their APIs and responses and other things. So backend testers are nothing but behind the scene API testers kind of with the way they are working on. So uh, I think the company like free charge and other things where I have seen backend testers are getting hired. They are nothing but the API testers behind the scenes. Okay. It's a growing industry guys. You will get a high salary, high package. Trust me. Uh, and it will basically boost up your resume also. If you know web API testing along with the web automation, good. If you know web API testing along with the manual testing, it's good. So you have to take care. And APIs are everywhere, guys. You are using Facebook application. You are using this uh, YouTube behind the scene. They are using REST API, right? So everything is everywhere, right? So you know. So these are the top important reasons. And make sure there is a study material that I have given you uh, in the link. Make sure you read this report. It looks like this. Uh, 2021, 2021 data for the API report and you can go through it. It's a very interesting uh, report to read and uh, you will learn a lot about the APIs, how people are leveraging the APIs, how they are creating it, how people are testing it, uh, what are the technologies like JSON and other things or tools which basically people are using for API testing and all. All right. So thanks a lot for watching this video and uh, I hope you have learned something new. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.